Water? Underwater. How is this possible? Here are nine spectacular underwater realms you've probably never seen before. Nine, the Monterey Submarine Canyon. The seafloor exhibits a stunning and diverse a landscape as the world we know above it. Yet how are underwater bodies of water, such as lakes and rivers, possible? These realms are formed when salt water seeps upward through a thick layer of salt deposits present under the seafloor. The seeping water causes the layers of salt to dissolve slowly, which then collapse into itself to form deep depressions. With this liquid being much denser than the water surrounding it, the salt water remains stagnant in these depressions, and here, divots of water are formed. Based on the distinct difference in the two types of seawater, the heavier form seems to move and flow in the same movement as a river or lake. Due to highly lethal concentrations of methane and hydrogen sulfide found within, the newly formed water cannot mix with the surrounding sea. Thus, the potency of the water can be deadly to any diver or animal who swims into it. For this reason, new forms of bacteria and sea creatures have evolved in order to survive this unusual environment. One river found flowing and churning around solitary rocks and bends won't show up in any tourist photographs. It lies two miles beneath the ocean surface in one of the biggest underwater canyons on the west coast, the Monterey Submarine Canyon. The river here serves as a torrent rivaling the Colorado River, famous for carving out one of the most visited sites in the world, the Grand Canyon. The bizarre underwater river of Monterey's Canyon does the same, stretching 200 miles away from the coast of California before splitting out to the typically flatter plains of the open sea. The massive underwater canyon beats out its land counterpart in size as well, plunging to depths four times that of the Grand Canyon. Scientists have found that the canyon has been shaped for millions of years by this phenomenal undersea channel, and the diverse nature of organisms found in such depths makes the Monterey Bay Aquarium one of the biggest marine research institutes in the world. 8. The Underwater Torrent of the Black Sea Another fascinating underwater river lies unnamed beneath the Black Sea and features wondrous waterfalls and swarming rapids. If this waterway were on land, it would be considered the sixth largest river in the world, based on the capacity of water which runs through it. This unnamed pathway is so massive, it holds ten times the amount of water than Europe's biggest river, the Rhine. Up to 35 meters deep and one kilometer wide, this churning channel snakes sneakily along the belly of the Black Sea. Due to its extremely high level of salinity, the water found here is physically prevented from mixing with the lesser salty waters of the surrounding sea. Scientists from the University of Leeds began tracking the river's progress with an underwater robot, until the machine vanished into the cavernous abyss at around 60 kilometers deep. 7. The Hazma River The Amazon River is one of the world's most diverse passages of water, and by far, holds the greatest flow of any river, surpassing the Nile, Mississippi, and the Yangtze combined. To further glorify this rich natural wonder, there is another spectacular body of water located 4,000 kilometers below its belly. The Hazma River is an underground river named after its discoverer, geophysicist Valia Hamza. Upon its unearthing in the 1980s, while the Amazon beats the latter in length, the Hazma River surpasses with an astounding 200 kilometers wide at its narrowest point and 400 kilometers wide at its girthiest. While this broad measurement may seemingly dwarf the mighty Amazon, the amount of water flow deems the Hazma a mere minnow in comparison. As water ebbs through the Hamza at a slow, steady trickle of 1 million gallons per second, it rushes through the Amazon at a whopping 35. Still, this underwater river is impressive in itself and adds to the allure and wonder encompassing beautiful Brazil. 6. The Cenote Angelita Cenote Angelita, translating to Little Angel, is a natural sinkhole which formed when rocks of limestone in the seabed collapsed to expose groundwater beneath. Famously linked with the Yucatan Peninsula in Mexico, cenotes were often used as sacrificial sites for ancient Mayan practice and ritual. What renders the Cenote Angelita most remarkable today, however, is the saltwater river found cascading along the bottom. 
Here, the hydrogen sulfide is so thick, it's seething with toxins that make the area so misty it's impossible to see without a torch. The mist acts as a natural barrier between the polluted salt water of the river with the fresh water surrounding it, while also preventing objects from falling into its deadly current. The chemicals from hydrogen sulfide and methane prove deadly to both humans and marine life. 5. The Denmark Strait Cataract this underwater waterfall rivals even the world's highest waterfall when typed into Google's search engine. To curb the curiosity of which is the highest, look no further than Angel Falls in Venezuela's Canima National Park. At a striking 979 meters, this amazing wonderwork is so tall it dissipates long before hitting its highly anticipated destination down below. Though this cataract, which translates to a large and powerful waterfall, isn't the highest in the world, if you consider its underwater counterpart. The Denmark Strait Cataract is an astonishing 3,500 meters tall and is nestled nicely under the Atlantic Ocean between Greenland and Iceland. When the reaction from cooler waters of Greenland Sea waft into warmer swells of the Sea of Erminger, anomalies such as the Denmark Strait manifest. As temperatures tease the point where each waterway intertwines, the cooler and denser water slips straight down to the ocean floor creating a cascading waterfall in its wake. Upon reaching the bottom, the cooler waters swerve south, jut back up to the surface to replace the water that was lost, and the entire cycle of liquid continues on. 4. The Unnamed Lake of Antarctica While a surface area of ice may not be a solid body of water, it's still fascinating to have something exist underneath, with no way of knowing what type of life thrives there. And besides, ice is like the fraternal twin to water, just a bit harder in character. Therefore, these next two bodies of water are a valid exception to this list. Along Antarctica's icy interior exists the largest subglacial lake, Lake Vostok, and as it's submerged under 3.7 kilometers of ice, scientists have yet to uncover the mysteries that lie within these unknown waters. The discovery of a new bacteria, however, Theories weighing toward the uncertainty that this lake contains unique organisms, which evolved independently to those familiar on Earth. The second largest subglacial lake and ecological epicenter is another fully submerged spectacle spanning Antarctica's crystal tundra. This unnamed body of water is unique because its only recognition thus far has been from the depths of outer space. In other words, scientists haven't exactly seen this colossal creation yet they know it's there. This existence and size of this unnamed phenomena have been analyzed through satellite images of the ice covering the surface of Antarctica. So while scientists have been unable to view or drill into the underwater lake, they can pinpoint its presence due to depressions in the area of the ice that prove consistent with other subglacial bodies of water. With a measurement of 100 kilometers long and 10 kilometers wide, researchers associate the lake shape with that of a ribbon. What's fascinating is that the unnamed lake has several feeders which travel over a thousand kilometers, most likely channeling water from the lake into the ocean. Since researchers are unable to access this massive body of water, they have no idea of the organisms that exist within. Scientists are developing a plan within the next few years to drill into the ice in hopes to uncover any unique life forms not yet seen on Earth. 3. The Hot Tub of Despair the hot tub of despair is as uninviting as the name suggests. This brine pool is set 1,000 meters below the water's surface in the Gulf of Mexico. According to science, the brine pool was formed over a million years ago. After the Great Gulf evaporated, researchers determine that as heaps of salt water were left behind, the brine submerged and then formed an underwater pool with the resurgence of new water. The unusually high density of the hot tub of despair is, of course, due to its salt content. So much so that objects which land on the surface are firmly held in place. Four times saltier than the surrounding sea, the hot tub of despair is so toxic that its lack of oxygen and abundance of methane would devastate any marine life who tried to venture near. Those tiny creatures, brave enough to enter the brine pool, never make it out alive, though their bodies become preserved for years to come. Over time, small organisms in the form of bacteria, mussels, and worms have adapted to life along the banks of this murky pool of brine. 2. The Mauritius Waterfall If this isn't considered one of the natural wonders of the world, it should be. 
The Mauritius waterfall looks so picturesque, it's as if Mother Nature painted it herself. Just below the water's surface, visitors can see torrents of aquamarine tumbling down into an underwater abyss. Situated off the coast of an island called the Republic of Mauritius, 2,000 miles from Africa's southeastern coast, the unbelievable display attracts oohs and ahs from spectators all over the world. And it is unbelievable because it's not real. The Mauritius waterfall is, in fact, an optical illusion. Yet the sight of cascading channels plummeting downward is so believable, people relish in the novelty nonetheless. The secret behind the illusion is due to sand and silt deposits which flow through the area and enhance the colour of the water to reveal a fluctuating cascade of silk transcending to… who knows where? Still, the Mauritius waterfall has become an attraction due to its beauty alone and onlookers can gaze down from helicopter rides where aerial shots make this faux dreamscape nothing short of reality. 1. An ocean inside the Earth When scientists speculated that Earth's water was formed by the Earth itself, it's due to evidence of an ocean under our ocean. Findings have uncovered a remarkable body of water located 660 kilometers within the Earth's crust. The large reservoir of water sits beneath eastern Asia and is reported to contain more water than three times the amount of all the world's oceans combined. Located within a massive mantle known as the Transition Zone, this region of water exists in a mineral known as Ringwoodite. When geological reactions shake the globe by way of earthquakes and volcanic eruption, little by little, water slowly seeps above ground. This ocean underneath the Earth's crust functions in two integral ways. First, it provides our own oceans with water, and second, it serves to regulate the functions of water circumnavigating the surface of the planet. Scientists claim that the world would be completely covered in water if it weren't for this amazing liquid abyss beneath Earth's external crust. Interested in other fascinating phenomena that exist underwater? Watch the latest videos and don't forget to subscribe to What Lurks Below.